It's St. Patrick's Day on the island of Sodor, and all the engines were working hard as usual. Or, I guess except for Gordon and James. You know, James, you could do some hard work for a change. Oh please, I'm the one that has to do some hard work. You're the one sitting in the shed doing nothing. Sounds to me like both of you need to do some hard work. Shut up, Percy. There's no reason for you to intervene. What are you doing here anyway? Getting a suntan at the beach. What do you think I was doing? Delivering stone to the harbor like I do every morning. <laughs> you know what today is, right James? What, Percy? It's St. Patrick's Day. So what? Don't you know the rule of St. Patrick's Day? I don't care. You have to wear green. I don't care. And if you don't, you get pinched. Percy, I couldn't get pinched even if you wanted me to. Well, if you want to avoid it, why not go to the works and get repainted green? I would look ridiculous in green. I don't know, James. Green might suit you. Whatever. You know what else happens today? You leave me alone now? No. You have to find a pot of gold and you can trade it to a leprechaun for three wishes. <laughs> Don't be silly, Percy. Oh, there's no such thing as a leprechaun. Of course there is. Oh, I thought by now you wouldn't be this naive, but you proved me wrong. I'll prove it to you, James. Leprechauns are real. Come on, Percy. We gotta get going. The signal's green. Plus, Sir Topham Hat wanted us to take some cars with machinery and engine parts to the works at Croven's Gate. I'd like to see you try. Oh, come on! A red signal? You are going at such a good pace! <gasps> Is that a pot of gold? Hello there, little green engine. I see you found me pot of gold. Hello, my name is Percy. If you'd like, you can trade this pot of gold to me, and in return, I give you three wishes. Really? Yes! Okay, Percy, what will your first wish be? Well, I wanted to get the latest iPhone with a green phone case. Okay, your wish is my command. Whoa! This is so cool! Thanks, Mr. Leprechaun! Of course, Percy. Now, what will your second wish be? Hmm... James has been trying to make something that gives engines superpowers. Do you think you can give him the ingredients for them? That seems somewhat difficult. What were the superheroes' names? Spring water and the pickle. Alright. I'll see what I can do. Did it work? Yeah. They should be in your friend James's shed right now. Okay, perfect. So, what will your third and final wish be? I'm not sure. What's there to wish for? You can wish for literally anything. Can you give me the power of telepathy? What? I can read people's minds. Um, okay. I'll try to. Did it work? I don't know. Wait, you have pots of gold placed around the world? What? What makes you think that? It's what you're thinking about, granting others wishes when they find your pots of gold. I suppose it did work. Yeah, I guess it did. Thanks, Mr. Leprechaun, for the wishes. Of course, Percy. I better get going. Goodbye! Looks like the signal's green. Better get this train delivered. Hello, James. Hello, Percy. What are you doing? Taking this train to Crovin's Gate. What about you? Oh, uh, getting ready to take a passenger train. Or, are you going to collect some ballast? What makes you say that? It's what you're thinking about, so that's how I know. What? But, but how? Now have fun collecting ballast, James. I don't have time to dwaddle about talking to you. One of these days, Percy, I'll get you back. One of these days.